In this screencast, I want to show you how to use a concept mapping tool called Mindomo in order to make a presentation. I'm going to start off by showing you what the finished presentation can look like, and then after that I'll spend a little bit of time demonstrating how to create a concept map and then demonstrating how to turn it into a presentation using this tool. I've already created a concept map which I'm going to use as the basis for my presentation and the concept map pertains to all the words in English that have developed from an ancient Indo-European source uh, namely the word Pele which meant to be flat or to spread. So let's start the presentation. This is the initial slide. I click the arrow at the bottom of the screen as you'll see there and that takes us over to a list of other words that have derived from that Indo-European source. This includes, for example, another Indo-European word, plat, which meant to spread. Also a Greek word, planastai, meaning to spread out or to wander. Another Greek word, plasin, meaning to spread out, to mold. Latin word, planus, meaning flat, level, plain, and so on. Let's move on to the next slide. What I'm going to do is focus on one of these descendants in particular, namely the Indo-European plat, meaning to spread. Let's look at its descendants. And it includes the Greek platus, meaning broad, Latin flato, meaning a flat cake, an old Swedish word flundra, meaning flat fish, an old wor Norse word flatra, meaning flat, and so on. And again, we're just going to zero in on one branch here, namely the Greek platus, which meant broad. So let's look at its descendants now. You'll see that there's a number of descendants. Uh, plate, platypus, platitude, platinum, place, plateau, and piazza. Let's look at each one of these in turn. So we'll start with plate. Uh, it's pretty obvious how the word plate is related to the idea of flatness. Plates are flat. I'll show you two. You'll see an icon here, a little globe. If we click this, it opens up uh, an online resource that I have hyperlinked to this node in the concept map in the presentation. I'll close that. Now I'm going to move on to the next part of the presentation. Platypus also derives from the same source, and over here you'll see there's a different icon. If I hover over it, this note pops up. A platypus is a strange creature that is named after its feet. The word platypus actually means flat foot. Okay, move on to the next one. Also the word platitude, another word in English which derives from the same source. And here I'll demonstrate how you can add an audio note in order to further explain things. A platitude is literally a flat statement. In other words, it's an old statement that is so worn out and so flat that it no longer has any edge to it. For example, a statement such as better safe than sorry is a platitude. Okay, now move on to the next part. Well, um, the Spanish word plata, which meant silver plate, also came from that same source. And from that, in English, we get the word platinum. And I'm going to show you how you can have a YouTube video or, or any video uh, also associated with this particular, with, with a node. Platinum is the rarest and heaviest of all the precious metals. All and so on. I'll stop it there. Then, if we wanted to, we could proceed through the rest of the items in this branch. The word place comes from the same source. The word plateau comes from the same source and the word piazza. All of those uh, topographical features uh, are characterized by their flatness. Then if I wanted to I could zoom out so we get an overview again. Uh, we can see in other words how from the Indo-European Pele over on the left hand side we got the Indo-European word plat meaning to spread that became the Greek platus meaning broad and then from that Greek source we got uh, we, we derived all of these English words that are listed there. And we could do that for all of the branches in this concept map if we wanted to. 
Turning a concept map into a presentation using Mindomo is quite easy. Here we have in front of us a concept map that I've already created. If we're ready to turn it into a presentation, we simply go up to the top right corner here, click this icon that's called Presenter, then you'll see this plus sign that appears, click it, and you simply use your mouse cursor to highlight whatever parts of the concept map you want to feature in your first slide. Click the plus sign again. Do the same thing to what you want to appear in the next slide. And again, what you want to appear in the third slide. And so on. Now let's have a look. We start there. Let's start the presentation. And the next slide. The next slide and so on. To get out of presentation mode just click escape and if you want to delete a slide you simply click the slide up here select delete slide if you want to re rearrange the order of slides just drag and drop them. So in short creating a presentation out of a concept map is really very easy using Mindomo.